Hey Honeyville Nation, welcome back to my channel. The name is Umpo Asakai. If you don't already know, <laughs> welcome back. It's so great to have you back here with me again. To all my regular subscribers, hey! <laughs> I appreciate the love so much, guys, especially the regulars. Oh my gosh, like I love you guys so much. You guys keep on pushing me, man. Like I really, really appreciate you. And if you have not subscribed, do the right thing for your girl and press that subscribe button. Thank you to all of you that have subscribed. Thank you. I cannot thank you guys enough. Now, today we are doing a different one. <laughs> I'm doing my first story time and it involves this box. Yeah, I already opened it. I had to open it, guys. I already opened it. And my drink of choice for today is this a brutal fruit strawberry rouge spritzer. I already opened it, my honey. So <laughs> I was a bit thirsty <laughs> anyway yeah story time so i got this package right from the mail it was sent by somebody from my instagram dms so before i reveal to you what this package contained let me just give you a backstory right <laughs> so fine um instagram i got a dm right and it was from this other guy i don't know him at all actually this guy has been hitting me up on instagram he's been liking my pictures he's been commenting um and let's say a month back he commented he's like you know i like you so much i actually want to send you something and i'm just like ah, this guy anyway so we don't always answer to dms on instagram or in boxes on facebook because some of these people are forex traders or some of these people are just weirdos or some just have an agenda right so i was like hmm okay let me click on this guy's profile i went on his profile and the first thing i checked was is he a forex trader nope no forex trader <laughs> no forex trader in his bio look at his pictures i'm like hmm okay he's lookable he looks decent um no forex whatever anything of, of the sort on his grid and i'm like hmm okay i was a bit intrigued by him um because he seemed like he seemed so decent man even via dm he was polite and stuff I was like, ah, okay, let me entertain this guy because he seems decent. He doesn't look like a weirdo at all. Let me just entertain him, you know. And then um, a few weeks back, I'm going to read this to you. <laughs> a few weeks back, I posted this picture on Instagram and then he DM'd me again. He's like, I like you, yes. And I'm like, um, okay, thank you. You know, because I don't know what to say. I can't say I like you too. I don't know the guy. I mean, he's anonymous. <laughs> anyway, or should I say he's a stranger? Not he's anonymous. He's a stranger to me. Anyway, so I was like, uh, okay, thank you. And he's like, please send, please send me your postal address. Everything is here. I can't show you who it is. And I hope you didn't, like, I hope I didn't show <laughs> his details because I don't want you to screenshot. Mm -mm, child. Anyway, um, he's like, please send me your postal address. And I'm like, are you serious? Because he said that to me the last time and I just ignored him. And then he said it again. He's like, send me your postal address. I want to send you something nice because like, I like you. And I'm like, oh my gosh. I'm like, are you serious? Or are you just playing with me? He's like, I'm not joking. I'm like, ooh, lol, next thing I'll see you at my doorstep. So he's like, no, never. I'm like, oh my gosh, this guy. Like, I was so intrigued. <laughs> this is all happening via Instagram DM, okay? And then I'm like, are you serious though? He's like, I'm dead serious, I'm poor. He's like, I'm not playing, nyan nyan. So that already told me he's Kosa. Hmm. Kosa men, I've had a history with Kosa men. And um, some was good and some was not <laughs> but i was like okay at least he's not foreign um uh, no offense to my foreign brothers and sisters okay so he's Kosa. and then i'm like oh you flattered me too much he's like you deserve something very nice from me hmm. at this point i'm just like hey i hope this guy's not catfishing me but what do i have to lose you know he looks decent I checked his profile guys he looks decent i know i said this before there are weirdos on the internet but this guy looks decent and then he's like please test me i'm like uh okay let's see if you're serious and then he's like oh great 
and then I gave him my work address instead of my home address right and then he's like great I'll forward you the tracking codes first thing I'm like yeah but to this guy <laughs> and he's like watch me do it I'm like okay I'm like I don't know what I should say but I'll probably say thank you once I get the package he's like no you don't have to say it now you can say thank you once you get your package I'm like okay and then a few days passed I forgot all about this guy because we didn't say anything to each other on Instagram right few days passed and then um, on a Thursday he's like please send me your full names uh, for your parcel <laughs> I'm like I thought you were joking what is the parcel and he's like send me fast please so now I'm assuming he was at the courier company waiting for me to send him uh, my details my full details and then I'm like wait should I trust you and he's like yes just send because I'm here already and I want to send this to you like now and I'm like okay um I gave you my work address he's like okay that's fine and then I'm like should I trust you because I'm like should I trust this guy or not <laughs> <laughs> he's like yes please trust um, <clears throat> please trust me and then he's like i sent it as mpo, I'm, i hope you're the only mpo at your workplace i was like um yeah but my gut is telling me to trust you so please don't disappoint me and then i'm like um yeah i'm the only mpo at work and then this is what he said he's like it's a perfume from skin cosmetics he's like it's the new range so you're the first one to own a bottle <laughs> remember i don't know this guy from a bar of soap i don't know him at all he just hit me in my dms and he decided to send me a gift so yeah he's like it's their new range so you will be the first one to own the bottle i'm like hmm, nice and then he's like very exclusive <laughs> and then i was like okay i'll say thank you all once i've received it and then guess what guys he sent me a picture actually sent me a picture of the box he's like look i sent it okay i opened it anyway so he's like i sent it um and i'm like oh my word i really didn't believe him but my gut told me to trust him and then fast forward uh monday afternoon he's like your parcel is on its way so i didn't give him my cell phone number he still doesn't have my cell phone number until today so this package arrived on monday today is thursday right and then he's like your parcel is on its way so i'm assuming they called him to tell him what a, what a look um we're on our way to go drop off and post parcel and then he's like i hope you love it <laughs> and i was like Woo! i was so excited at that point i'm like oh my gosh i'm getting excited i'm like thank you for keeping me posted because you were so polite like he kept me posted all the way okay mm. Mm. this is so yummy guys so yummy so anyway i received the parcel i was in shock but i was just like oh wow <laughs> hey guys when i opened this package i was pleasantly surprised so in the package came these um two samples from juliet has a gun um you're the perfume the vapor Ooh, guys okay <laughs> let me open it and it was first this sample smells amazing okay it smells absolutely wonderful oh my gosh and then the second one was also a sample let me just open it also the same size bottle also smells heavenly guys heavenly these perfumes definitely leave a statement behind it's like i was here i left a piece of me and you can smell me all you want because i'm staying okay <laughs> it's these perfumes right here and then um the bigger one was this one it's the new range as he said i checked it up online guys as soon as i got this gift as soon as i opened it i checked it out online okay i wanted to check first how much it is and because oh here's the packaging gorgeous right when you open it like this and then it's like this so yeah like i said it looks like this when you open it up and here's the lovely bottle it smells amazing guys i don't want to lie to you it is so gorgeous oh my gosh it threw me off a bit because i was like okay black is this not for a man 
and then I checked it online I actually went on Google and I checked it's a unisex perfume smells absolutely amazing and I had to check how much it costs <laughs> I had to okay yeah so I went on the skin cosmetics website here it is and then I clicked on fragrances let me just wait for it to open went on fragrances and then I typed in Juliet has a gun Juliet has a gun um, hundred more Juliet has a gun, mask invisible, um, a hundred more. Look at how much it is. 2,430 Rand for this bottle. <laughs> wow. Okay. Wow. And then, yeah, like I said, I wanted to check the description of the perfume. It smells so great. It's definitely a statement fragrance fragrance it's definitely a statement fragrance it smells so sexy it leaves a piece of you behind okay um what does it say here a fluffy scent as comfortable and unfussy as your favorite old pair of jeans mm, a dreamy and nostalgic smell of comfy notes laying on a silky base of creamy musk the perfect fusion of body and soul <laughs> i still haven't given this guy my numbers okay i sent him a dm saying thank you and he's like I really, really hope you'd enjoy it. Only the best for you. I'm just like, oh my goodness. <laughs> wow. <laughs> mm. Mm. Moral of the story, kids. Answer your DMs. <laughs> you never know if you're going to meet the right person or not. Um, I prefer that you literally you should go through their profile first before you start entertaining them check if this person is serious check if they don't have a history with other people you know you must ask your friends Jorge, has this person um inboxed you has this person inboxed you like ask maybe like five people Jorge, look on instagram Jorge, look has this person inboxed you because you know these people some of them are like catfish okay some of them catfish some have agendas and whatnot so yeah do your research first before you respond i don't want you ending up in a ditch child and saying it's my fault mm -mm. do your research first before you respond to that dm honey <laughs> so i got this i'm gonna smell good for days good for days <laughs> Thank you for joining me, my honeys, and thank you for watching until this far. Do give this video a thumbs up. Do let me know if you still, if you want more story times from me, because I got a lot, I got a lot, okay? <laughs> so let me know if you want more story times. And yeah, after this video, I am cooking nachos. So do stick around or go actually to my next video. Go to my next video. I'll be making nachos. I'll be making nachos. Go to my next video. Don't forget to subscribe, okay, my honeys? And I will see you literally in the next video. Love and appreciate you all. Bye. <laughs>